Hi, I'm Kyle Iverson. I'm here for Casino Enterprise Management at G2E 2012. And I'm joined by Mike Brennan, Product Marketing Manager for Spilo International. Thanks for your time today, Mike. No problem, thank you. So, we're on the second day of G2E. What, have you, what were the highlights so far on day one? You know, what's big for us is we're uh, launching a partnership with PopCap, which is a casual game maker. They pretty much invented uh, the casual game in 2000, and we partnered them with three titles, Plants vs. Zombies, uh, three of their brands, Zuma and Bejeweled. And uh, what we're doing is we're having a lot of buzz over uh, kind of the introduction of these games to the market. Uh, for us, this is a, a new type of license, and for the market, it's a new type of license. So instead of having a nostalgic movie or a musician, we're going with established games that have followings uh, online, in PC versions, you know, on mobile devices, via Facebook, and we're bringing them to, to casinos with the hope that uh, we're going to bring new players into the casino. We're going to hopefully uh, get table games players to check this out, saying, oh, hey, I didn't know they made a slot version of Plants vs. Zombies. Uh, on the same token, we're also trying to make sure that we are satisfying regular players uh, surprising them with some of the features, but making sure that they're happy and it's got some of the standard gaming elements that they're used to in a, in a slot machine. Definitely. So if there's one thing that you want attendees to take away from your booth this year, what would that be? Um, just that we have a long-term partnership, like I said, with PopCap, and that we're trying to be different with our licensing approach. You know, we're trying, uh, we're trying not just to roll out, like I said, like the, the old standard type of games. and. and a good example of that is we're introducing some elements that maybe are, are newish to slot players. So take away the fact that we're evolving players too. So we're launching Plants vs. Zombies uh, beginning of next year, and it's kind of the gateway brand. It's uh, you know pretty standard game, but it's got some neat interactions, one-to-one -one animations, uh, sounds uh, from the casual game. And then we're evolving players into Zuma, which actually has some physical skill. Uh, and then over to Bejeweled, which is a non-spinning reel slot with uh, a ton of actual skill and strategy and different uh, ways of, of uh, dealing with uh, betting structures and so that, you know. In general, we're, we're trying to, to meet the needs of, of players and, and casinos with, uh, in one way, one of our, one of our bullets is this PopCap pop brand. Fantastic. And what sets Spilo apart from its competitors? Um, you know what? That's a really good question. I would say, uh, I can go into some some corporate speak of this app, but I really think it's the people. Uh, we have people that, that really care. We've, we've, uh, we have really long tenured employees. You know, we don't, we don't churn and burn. We, you know, our market facing people, sales, service, you know, operations have been with us a while. Um, and almost the energy almost feels like a startup. We are part of a giant uh, Loud America group, which is the largest, uh, I think, gaming company in the world. Um, you know, in this segment, this North American casino segment, the excitement that's been building over the last couple of years, uh, you can kind of feel it in our booth. You know, we're, we're not at the front of the booth, we're not giant, but we got a lot of buzz back here. I think you see it with, with some of our game functionalities and some of the, the energy that, that our people bring. So, you know, I really I really like the people. You know, I wouldn't be here if, if I didn't, and I think that sets us apart. So what does the future hold for Spilo? Um, you know, it actually holds a lot. You know, we're, we're like most people, growth is important. Responsible growth, uh, being honest with, with our customers, growing one bank at a time, growing two units at a time, uh, but we do compose a big percentage of growth uh, within our group, and I think you're going to see us kind of sneak up on some people and, and really, really get a get a bigger chunk and get get more respect and, and, and just really roll out a lot of a lot of good games in the next couple of years. Fantastic! Thanks for your time today, Mike. No, no problem. Thank you. Remember, you can check out more videos at CasinoEnterpriseManagement.com.